Hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft with Mayday. Uh, today we are going to go over to the Twilight Forest again and ahead to the Troll Caves. But first, Floof is really excited to show us updates that he's done to his home. So we got to do that first. Hey Floof. I have not realized how massive this lightsaber is. Your lightsaber is very cool. I approve. I also have this. What's that? That's a minigun. You have a minigun, okay. I have a minigun. Okay, I'm a little concerned. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna head over the bridge to Floof's house. He also planted a bean. There's a bean. Magic bean. But well, we'll talk about that later. Hey! Pride legs! Woo! Yeah. 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 I changed my lights to these. Oh, I like those lights. Thank you. Lead on, sir. The flags are really cheap to make, so I like So you made some nice decorations? made a lot of you made a lot of flags. I made, like, at least 50. 50 flags. There's too many flags. Painting. What's this? This is that's, wool? That's my wool clothing for winter. Oh, look at the clock. A clock? Yeah, I is thought it was going to be a full grandfather clock. It, it isn't. I approve of this clock. Is that a deco craft clock? That, no, it's a, that's a bibliocraft. Bibliocraft? You can yeah. see in the top of your screen. Oh. Uh, hi. Where? Top. Middle. Oh, there. Uh, bibliocraft uh, in blue. Uh, so do I need a special table to make bibliocraft stuff? No, just crafting table. It's a cookie jar. Yeah, it's a cookie jar. And in here we got my bedroom where I all changed more lights and added some paintings. Uh, I think you should walk into that painting. Which painting? This, this one. Th this painting? Yeah, right there. Ah! Oh. <gasps> what has happened? They're not working. You fool. I'm disappointed. <laughs> what? What? Look down. They're not... Yeah. My hover activated. That's dumb. They're not working on your screen. Would you like me to continue to fall? No, you're supposed to fall down. It's For some reason you can stand on them, but like... Um, they're supposed to have a picture on them, and they, they don't. Oh, that's too bad. For you, and it's... It's an um, interesting trap that you have. Yeah. It doesn't work. I think it might be because it's, like, based on the download picture that you have, so, like, everyone on the server would have to have the picture downloaded. Oh, you should go into that one, too. What one? This one? No. This one? I'm on fire. Yeah, so am I. No, like... I'm trying. There. Oh, what's this? Welcome to the room. Hey, you got the Questine Ram Trophy! Yeah. But, 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 but we're supposed to get that together. I didn't know how to do it, and then I started it, and I was like, oh, I better finish this so we can do a new one. Yeah, so there's another one spawns? That's cool, so it's a hidden trophy. It's yeah, great. and also I found its item. It's a horn that when you hold it, it just starts breaking stuff. Oh, cool. And I also sort. Um, why? Why is it? Hello, doggo. Why is are it? they up here? Are they supposed to be somewhere else? They're supposed to be in here. Hello, doggos. Yuki and Okami. I don't know why. Well, uh, this is my. Uh, there's nothing behind this painting. Uh huh. Just making sure. Uh. This is just my forge, and then through here. Oh, you made the new doors. It's still not working. It's a meme about D and D. Oh well. That's mean. Uh, through here we got my, you know, this space. Yeah, but I remember this space. And it was mostly just changed the doors, and I added some things. And oh, you haven't seen this yet. No. This is the arcane infusion table. Okay. It's what I used to make uh, your you guys' uh, Viz am amulet of Viz and uh, your Verdant Heart Crystal Charm. Ah, okay. And it also makes other stuff, like there's these stabilizers, which will keep this from exploding. Okay. And basically works like a crafting table, but on steroids. They're really... Cool looking crafting. And then room. over, and then you see you take like uh, the jars of uh, Sentia in here, mm -hmm. uh, and specific ones will, specific recipes will need specific things. And you can 
You're like a mad scientist, you know that, right? Makes it, uh, you want to see mad scientist? You come through here. Okay. Artifice. Um... Don't, don't tap on the glass. Karen's room, don't tap on the glass. What? Karen was a blaze. Uh, the blaze disappeared. And now Karen is gone? Yep. Okay. This viz generator. This is a viz generator. It generates electricity for this thing, which charged my lightsaber. Infernal furnace. Isn't, uh, do you have any ores? Uh, no. Okay, here, let me grab some ores. Get me back back. Or, no. Give it a sec, my computer has to load. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, okay, there, there we go. Or, uh, grab some, just some, like, the furnace looks angry. Deep iron. See what you can do is you can take some ore or just anything that can be cooked or smelted. Mm -hmm. And then you go up, come up top here and there's just an opening. And you just throw it in. Okay. And then you'll see. Oh. It spits it out in front and it comes in here. And it, uh, it'll all, it'll like smelt stacks of stuff and you can just dump as much as you want. It does it very quickly. And it gives uh, extra nuggets of the same material. Hello. And right here is a pattern crafter. So if I go here and grab this bits of iron, see how the pattern, I can change the pattern with this. Mm -hmm. You can see it's kind of changing. Mm -hmm. But if I get it to the full crafting table, and then it is currently off right now, I'll put in nine deep iron ingots. And then, oh, it's already on. Okay, it did it one thing once. And now I have a deep iron block. I like that block. So to do really simple uh, patterns. Just put them all through, huh. like that. Yeah. Let that go. Let's see. And oh, this I have a few of these because I didn't realize they do a nine like the the. Uh, okay, so what these do is they can either detect the viz levels or the flux levels in an area. Oh. And uh, but the area I thought was one uh, chunk. It's actually a uh, nine nine chunk area. Oh. Uh, where this block's chunk is the middle one. Mhm. Mm and I made like four of them, thinking, oh, I should spread this out because my house is in a few chunks. Mhm. Mm um. Yeah, I didn't need to. So I just have them in different rooms. And you can see that this is just like, uh, they're fluctuating a bit. And here is very low, because... Is this the viz? This is the flux. And then that's... This, this the... is viz. This is the good thing. This is the bad thing. Okay, so the bad thing is under control. Yes. And then in here is nothing, because uh, I haven't done any golemancy stuff yet. Ah, so that's gonna be your golemancy room? Yeah. I try to get these to have like the Mechania and the Metallum ones for artifice. Hi, Here. Karen. Here's my. Uh... Ah. Ooh. Everything's purple. You look interesting. This is my mithril armor. What is it? Makes entities glow. Okay, that's how it makes them glow. Am I glowing? Uh, no, you just turned bright purple. Oh. Which I mean, kind of, but this one, this one gives a jump boost. Boing. What? Which is cool. Yeah, that's the uh, astral silver. That is pretty cool. So, should we head out, or do we have more to see? There is not more of the house. Uh, I made a different thing okay. in my little forest. Okay. Still don't know how these guys got here. They wander. Okay. So take a, take a stroll with me. Taking a stroll with you. The beanstalk. Over here you can see the beanstalk. What's this? Pride flag! Many pride flags. Many pride flags on the beanstalk. And you can read this? This way to the gay shack. Enjoy the walk. What? Come with me. I found blocks. You found blocks? And I, in combination with the pride flags. Do you like the view? Yes, I like the view. I, I, I made it, I accidentally made a bunch of signs, so I was like, I'm gonna use them. 
many flags. Much flagged them. I am trying to turn the twilight oak into a twilight rainbow oak. Oh, is that why that was happening? I thought yep. it like nope. was getting corrupted I'm or something. I'm doing it on purpose. Somehow. I'm doing it on purpose by cutting down rainbow trees and... Oh, could you do that with the beanstalk sleeves? Uh, maybe? Probably? Um... Oh, we're halfway there. And we're almost up to the top. I hear a sheep. What on earth? I found blocks. What on earth? I found blocks. This is a combination of chisel and I think another mod. Chisel and the future of blocks from something else. Welcome to the gay shack. And the, Enjoy your stay. And the uh, Maelis' doors. So welcome. Don't let any of them out. Holy. It is bright in here. Brightness. Uh, there are rainbow... Uh, Seizure warning. There are rainbow lamps. But uh, they don't actually change colors. It's based on the redstone signal. So I are these say. sheep changing colors too? Yes, they're all Jeb sheep. They're all Jeb sheep. So they change colors. Maybe you should name it the Pride Shack instead of the Gay Shack. Okay. What? That's fine. I'll do that. It seems like a nicer name because it's you know not just gay. It's got everything in here. Yeah. These are all future blocks. Um, this is nuts. This is this is this is mainly because they all had the most rainbow stuff I could find. This is like some they're, they're all Thor rainbow. Ragnarok stuff going on here. You could make if you use. We could make the Bifrost. If you use the fab, they're also super easy to make. If you use the fabulously wavy, you could definitely make a Bifrost if you wanted to. Rainbowliciously wavy. <laughs> this is insane. Now you just need the bed to change colors. Yeah, I don't know if I could do that. Holy... The doors are cool. The doors don't change colors because the animations didn't transfer through the... That's okay. Welcome to the pride shack. I like pride Oh, and then there's a then there's a, a dropper challenge. Dropper challenge? Where you try to drop down and land in the water. The bottom. Nope. Yeah. Nope. My my saving from death boots thing. Yeah. My jetpack has an automatic hover mode when it thinks I've fallen too far. I've fallen. I approve of the pride shack. Did you change the sign down here? Yes. Um. Anything else to see? Is there? Uh. You know, just checking. No, like um, I've just been cutting down the rainbow trees. In saving the leaves. Oh, there is something to see. Someone blew up a part of my arcane bathhouse. <laughs> Looked like a creeper explosion and no one fixed it, so I had to do that. Wait, what part of it got blown up? Like, inside. Inside? A yeah. creeper got inside? Did you get it fixed okay? It was over here, it was just... What's this? I don't remember these lights. Decorated paper lantern. Oh, pretty. Hey, I forgot I put rice in there. What the happened with Juan? Did George do something? I don't know. He didn't say anything. Did George have troubles? <laughs> Was there an incident? <laughs> Did George die? Maybe there was an incident. Everything else looks okay. Oh yeah, I added a bunch of the guards too. That's the thing. Like, come to your farm. To the to to the side in the back. To the to the barn. Barn. Yes. I didn't spell it right. I am Galaxy Brand. Okay. You're too fast. I am too fast. I really need to give Can't up speed. spell things. And Famer. Man. Famer. Famer Gollum. This is Famer Gollum. Wait, there's only one sheep left. Yeah. What happened to my sheep? Yeah. This is a disappointment. The sheep the sheep are dwindling. I stole them and put them in the in the in the pride shack. Oh. Well, 
I can get you more. You need to get more sheep because right now we've only got one sheep to get wool from if we need wool. Um, there is still more though of uh, those guys uh, in the in Jorsha's place. You put one in the computer shed. It should still be in there, hopefully. Yeah, it's still in here. I do like how I spelled farmer wrong, but still got mechanic correct. <laughs> Um, oh wait, what's this? Is this a new smelter? Or was no, this. Wow, that's the one we added at the start of the game. Yeah, shush, sure, sure. don't, don't check. Uh, and then there's, I think we should go up here. Up the thing that I can't go up. Yeah, because you're bad at the game. Okay, there's vines everywhere. I don't. Because you broke it. Shh. Never fixed it. I, I approve of all the vines. I'm coming. Caretaker. Oh, cool. Oh, I should also show you my new skin. Hey! Very nice. Oh, it has another one. Cool. I approve. Okay. Um, how many of these did I make? I'm trying to remember. Uh... I'm pretty sure... So just an update on what we're at, where we're at right now, guys. This episode is going to pretty much just be Floof gives us a tour. The next episode will be... We go and do the troll caves. I, I'm fairly sure I have more. There's the one... Well, there's the one in Batania. Uh, yes. My Batania house. There's the one in your house. In my house? In your house. In there's two house. in your house. There's two in my house. This house is big. Butler. There's another one in your room. In my room? You're not in there? No, he's not in your room. In the basement? He's in the basement. Goblin boy. <laughs> <laughs> basement. You should have named him Basement Troll. That's Goblin Boy. He's Goblin that lives in your basement. And don't try to fight him. He will steal your water. He will? No. Just. The. Hello, goblin. Did you see that I have water access over here? I could get a goblin from Twilight Forest and put it down here if I wanted to. In a cage? Cage. Oh, clear stable blood. I have fallen. Yes, I said I had water access. You weren't listening to me. You're, you're underwater now, sir. Paper. You're, you're, you're under. Go, goodbye. 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 Have a fun time. No oh, goblin. Let's get this straight. This is my basement, not your basement. My basement. You behave in this basement. Gotcha? Gotcha. I can't read it. Can't read what? The UI for your armor's in the way. We can have a cookout. Did you see that? I've got a grill. I'm not sure how the grills work. Neither am I. It looks like you make kebabs. Should I be able to access the grill? No. Okay. Wait, what's Lambs. What's that? What? What's that? What is that? Oh! That. Oh! That was some little... <laughs> okay, follow me. It's <laughs> a fun event. What? So you see, um, I got a uh, a giant chance. You popped a giant chance cube that close to our home. It was far enough away for nothing to happen. Um, what is this? It spawned a mansion. It spawned a, a, a. And then the mansion blew up. And then no, 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 no. You see, inside the uh, inside the mansion, I did a normal chance cube. 
and then a block of lava spawned, which burned down the entire building. Oh, well, um, we almost had a cool mansion. Well, I mean, it was, like, pitch black in so many areas where it caused a ton of mobs to spawn, so, like, it was... Yeah. So, oh, yeah, this is where the block of lava is. Here, Brian is still here. I think we discussed you not using chance cubes anywhere near home. Not near home. It's... it's I can see home from here. That, Excuse your render distance is too high. I can see home. That makes it too close. And what's what's this? What's this? What's what? This is that village type thing close to our home. What's 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 this? What is that? What's what's this? Where are you? Did, did you pop a chance cube over here too? Yes. Are you just trying to ruin all of the landscape? I you can fix it. Hospital fix. This is how mods work, okay? You just you I do have possibly the best pickaxe in the entire world. Just because uh, Tinker's Construct is ridiculous. Um, I could clean it if you really want me to. I'm, I'm not overly worried about it right now. It would have been cool to see the mansion before you blew it up. What's this? Molten ash- Molten Silver? Oh yeah, that spawned- I, I, I did a few while it was burnt because I was like, yeah, I got too many. Do I have any more in my backpack? No, no more chance cubes. No, no more. No, no more. You are banned. Banned, I sir. Could spawn. Banned. I, Banned. I could spawn magic beans. Banned. Uh, I've been making a terrestrial artifact. Banned. Which is used. It's a. Uh, this looks like it was probably really cool before it, it died. Kind of was, and I didn't mean for it to burn down, but it just kind of went. Well, what did you think was going to happen when you started opening other chance cubes inside of it? Uh, not this. Well. Welcome to Chance Cubes. Yeah. Still, I don't understand why Hero Brian is still here. He's been standing in this lava for days. He has like he has like full diamond armor with um, and he has like 500 health. Oh, he's really close to dying though. He's just sitting in the lava though, so I can't like. Do anything. Maybe. But yeah, it was pretty cool. You, uh, I was considering maybe using it for something before it burned. Before you burnt it to the ground. Yes. Try to push him out of the lava. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. You're fine. I use gun. Yeah, can't see. Um, here he's at like thirty-nine health. Even he's like barely taking damage from the lob. Yeah, he has twenty-two armor. Which is pretty good. For like a zombie. Try to make some space so you can push him out of the lava, but he doesn't really he doesn't really take knockback. I can kinda of push him. Here we go. I don't know why he's just decided to stay in there. Mm, nope. He's almost dead. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, five, uh, I can't see. Four, two, one, one. He has died. Would you, why am I flying away? Oh, you shoot me with your bow. You can have the wrath of your O'Brien. The wrath of your O'Brien. Oh, cool. I have a sword. So yeah, this is um, an interesting episode. I can make you one of these sort, one of these lightsabers if you want. I think I would like a lightsaber. Would it be better than my current sword? Um, it probably not. It has eleven damage. 
I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of fond of Clevenstein. It's growing on me. <clears throat> I've just been using it because I got a sunstone from a chance cube, and I was like, what's this do? Well, so this is um, uh, chaos near our home. Chaos. I can get rid of it if it is that much of an eyesore. Uh, uh, It'll have to be done later. Future projects. Future. You won't even need to be included. I can do it myself. Oh. Just to, so you don't it's this. become sad. Oh, yeah. This is just one of those small things where water just spawned. Oh. Yeah, and then there's the those poor villagers and then i spot and then it gets spikes okay see there's home right there Here chance him. cube too close too close okay, these are big but they don't affect that wide too close don't like it too close you know we're also too close this is a dungeon right here this is a whole dungeon not from a chance cube but this is a whole dungeon what is uh this little castle thing Ooh. wait a minute this could be wait a minute episode. Kingdoths and uh, Bearded Bane's Murder House. Is this a group on the server? I don't know. Are they players? Uh, this does look like it's been someone's gone Bearded Bane sounds familiar. I think it's one of the players. Okay, because they also claimed the village. They claimed it? Apparently. I gotta look at the. I read map. a sign. No, no, it's they... not a claimed area, it's the sign on near the like in front of the mansion so maybe you shouldn't have oh no it's oh my god look at the mansion on the map yeah it's it's big uh yeah yeah uh, claimed by king and bane that that doesn't count uh interesting um why did they have to claim something so close to us yeah well it isn't actually claimed so not claimed land i'm sure they're very pleased about the chance cubes you set off in there well, I didn't know because they said one sign. It didn't actually claim the area. Oh, Lord. This was a cool mansion, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Well, everybody, <laughs> thank you so much for joining us today on our episode of Minecraft with Mayday. And it was just, um, we'll do our some Twilight Forest fun in the next episode, but we just did our touring of interesting changes that Floof has made in the area. We're going to um, have a chance cube intervention now, I think. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for joining us. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like and subscribe button. It helps us know that we're doing good and you're having fun. And we will see you in the next video.